Hi guys, so today we are going to be filming a low carb, no sugar meal, I believe, right? There would be no sugar in any, right? I don't think so. I don't think so either. Okay, anyways, um, and I have Jessica with me and she's a vegetarian, so we are going to try this wild rice and mushroom sausageless sausage. Sausageless sausage sounds disgusting, but the wild rice and mushroom sounds good. So we have the wild rice and mushroom sausageless sausage. Why can't I say that? Um, lentils that are already opened, so that's why they're in this bag. We have yellow squash, cauliflower rice, broccoli rice, um, diced onions, these cute little garlic things from Trader Joe's, and then shiitake mushrooms. And then we also have coconut oil spray, and this is super easy. <laughs> We're just going to be using these pans right here, and it doesn't take long to cook at all, okay? We just need to chop everything. thanks to Jess for letting me use her really nice kitchen. We are going to put some olive oil, my favorite. And then we're gonna start first with the garlic cloves because those need to cook, can you help me? Those need to cook way more, those just need to cook longer so that we can really get some taste out of this, or flavor out of this, I should say. This works. And we know that we're not chefs and we're not using the proper tools here, but we don't really care. I'm gonna turn it up or down? Uh, yeah, turn it up a little bit. Usually I just wait until I can smell the garlic and then I start throwing stuff in. Actually, do you know what I wanna do with this first? I'm gonna put like a tiny bit of olive oil on it. Oops, that's kinda of a lot. Um, and then a little bit of garlic salt. Can you open this? Mm -hmm. And then just smooch of garlic salt. <laughs> <laughs> Why was that a lot? That was not a smidge. Really? <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right. These take like longer to saute, so I put them in first, and then we'll put in the cauliflower, cauliflower rice and the broccoli rice um, later because that doesn't take that long to cook. I'm a bad chef. I forgot the diced onions. <laughs> I have to buy diced onions. I can't cut them myself because my eyes are so sensitive to the onions. I don't know why. I like really start crying and they like hurt for like a week. Is that weird? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Look at Jess and her sauteing skills. Um, you're about to cook this weird sausage that we have, so be prepared. I'm about to do that? Yeah. Okay, now that we got that cooking, we're gonna take some cauliflower rice. Cauliflower, for people who have colitis like me, is a little bit hard to digest. So I don't do too much, like don't overdo it with it. Um, but yeah, typically cauliflower and broccoli and Brussels sprouts are a little bit hard to digest, but I'm using them anyways because this is low carb. And also, we just realized that olive oil is fattening, but it's fine. We just did it. We just did it anyways. <laughs> All right, um, now let's put in the lentils. And then Jessica's gonna make the sausage. Mm -hmm. Do you know how? Sure. Sure. <laughs> <laughs> So these lentils are from Trader Joe's. Um, they're already cooked and you can just eat them cold if you'd like. I like to warm them up though. They're the best lentils. Ever. Yeah, I they're love really those. good. But they come out in like this weird package, so. And they just like, I mean, you don't need to add lentils, but they just like add a little something, I think, to the flavor of the dish. Mm. 
Can you go, can I? <laughs> All right. I usually, see my plan was to bake the sausage, but it says don't bake on there. Or like there's no directions to bake it. Yeah. Um, it says let this it brown good. over medium heat. Okay, Salt and then flip it. All right. Yeah. That's actually good. Mm -hmm. And a lot of times I like to add shrimp to this as well. Um, I was just that too lazy. Amazing. I know. Well, okay, Jessica is a vegetarian, but she eats, what is it? I'm a pescatarian. A pescatarian. So I eat she fish eats and fish. All other seafood. Okay, so she eats seafood, but I forgot about that part. So on the way here, I was like, oh, I'm going to stop and get shrimp. But then I was like, oh no, Jess can't have it. But sorry, um, sorry about that. But yeah, usually I'd add some shrimp to this. But it's fine. We're good with our sausage-less sausage. Okay. All right. I think that we should take this, at least, like, turn this off. Okay. We're well, done. let's taste, um, right here. Because everything else is going to be cut, but these are going to take a while. Okay. Taste it. <laughs> <laughs> it's going to be really hot. They're hard. <laughs> They're hard. <laughs> okay. All right. Well, let them cook a little more. So Jessica's got some nice brownage going on with her. Yes. Tofurky so like over we're here. We're going. It's doing well. It's not tofurky, but there was no. tofurky there, and I was like laughing at myself. <laughs> so and then now we're gonna yeah. let it sit for three minutes. Yeah. Um, reduce heat to low. And let it sit for three minutes. I so wonder how this is gonna taste. Continuing to turn it. We might. <laughs> What if it makes us sick? It's not gonna make us sick. Why would it make us sick? I don't know. I just want everyone to know that I had this recipe down, but then I like changed it a little bit for my vegetarian friend, and then I found new stuff at the store. So now it's just really like a guinea pig recipe at this point. <laughs> guinea pig? <laughs> a guinea pig recipe. It's like it's like I don't know really what I'm just you know You're I'm just... not a pro at it. I'm just winging it. That's what it is. I'm winging it. Mm -hmm. But I mean, this it looks delicious. Yeah. We're going to be good with that. Mm -hmm. We'll see about that sausage. Well, we we'll <laughs> <laughs> only put two of them on there. Too. I didn't want to cook the whole thing. Oh, look, it looks pretty. I like the brown. Yeah, part. it looks good. <laughs> it looks like sausage. Yeah. Just not. Let me turn this off because it's already cooked. Just staying warm. Oops. I did this tofurkey roll thing one time for Thanksgiving. Uh huh. And it made me really sick. Really? <laughs> yeah. It was really bad. Like it and physically my, made you sick? Yeah, and my dad was like, well, that's what you get <laughs> for eating fake meat. <laughs> oh my god. Great. <laughs> we need to like take a bite of this before we throw it and mix it in here. Yeah, we will. All right, and she's chopped it up now, so she okay, can go. try it. Come on, you pescapillion. <laughs> <laughs> Pescatarian. It's gonna burn my mouth. You picked the biggest piece. I know. I'm gonna do small ones. There we go. Okay. Okay. <laughs> I forgot that you also don't like mushroom. Whatever. Ah. What is it? What's going on there? You like it? It's good? Yeah. Does I it mean, taste like sausage? I mean, it tastes like a veggie, veggie sausage. Do the small one or cut one in half. I'm gonna, I'm gonna cut one in half so okay. it's super well cooked. Yeah, I, that's why I, like, I wanted to overcook them. They're way better like that. <laughs> <laughs> well done, Tofurky. Just eat it. <laughs> mm. Not bad, right? Yeah. Yeah. It tastes like sausage. Yeah. Woo! Okay. Cool. Oh, yeah. Oh. I'm making it pretty. Yeah, she would garnish it. <laughs> <laughs> should we do one more smidge of garlic salt? <laughs> um, or is it pretty garlicky? I know this looks like mush that you would eat in prison, but it's really good. 
Alrighty, and that's our meal. Low carb, no sugar, right? Yeah. Colitis friendly meal. And that was easy, pretty much. But we do, we are missing shrimp. Yeah. We're definitely missing shrimp. But that's okay. It's alright. Okay, say bye. 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 Thanks for cooking with Stacy and Jess. <laughs> <laughs> we will see so you next time. <laughs> we'll see you next time. <laughs>